Hola YouTube, my name is Ricardo Lino and I'm a wheel addict. Welcome to the Plan B Part 1 video. I was pissing myself and I was pissing myself because I'm actually very nervous. I don't know if, you rem if you've been in the same situation where you are nervous about something that you need to pee and poo. That's how I feel right now. And the reason why I feel like that, it's to start with, I'm with Samuel. <laughs> and right there, that little village that you see there it's called Belmont and it has probably the deepest bowl in Europe Samuel has been there before there were some dead cats dead snakes inside it's not the coolest thing but it's such a deep bowl where no one goes that if some animal goes inside can't sadly it can't go out I've never been there but I know it's pretty wild I know that a couple of years ago the guys from Treasure skateboard magazine they came here to make a video because no one else was skating it pro BMXers also came here they killed it inline skaters some people went there I'm not gonna kill it for sure but I'm gonna try to skate it if there's no animals inside but we needed someone that is actually good at skating so well, that's why I'm here. Uh, <laughs> I got the Portuguese champ with me. I remind you, this is just part one of plan B. If you don't know what plan A is, maybe watch the last video that I published. It was the last stream where I explained what was happening and why I had to do a plan B. I didn't told you what the plan B was and I'm not gonna tell you what the plan B part two is going to be. Stay with us. You guys need to see this. This is crazy. Can you can you hear it? Okay, I need to show it to you. Check this out. Just this is big. But it's nicely made, Sam, huh? I'm scared of dropping these and not being able to come out. I'm even shaking. I'm shaking. And now this is the other part. Come on, Bozo! I gotta tell you the truth. This thing is so scary. <laughs> I actually, I actually like to skate transitions, but me liking to skate transitions or me skating transitions or me talking about these skates are good for bowl. Usually they do not include a bowl like this. This is big boy shit. I know I'm big, but this is what I like to skate. This is fun. Now that one, I'm scared. I need to stretch. And what? You gonna drop that shit? Five euros oh, if you drop, drop it. Fuck it. Okay, that's me. Get it. <laughs> but I told you the last time how to drop something. That's how you do it. Hey! Hey! This is not the best group. It's a persistent way to know that. Dude, I did a McTwist right there. It just didn't stop because it was very dark. <laughs> Dude, it's very, very, very scary. Let's see. The sound, man, it's insane.
like I just won the X Games. Booyah! Come on, Takeshi, show me what you got. Is that all you need? Get out of my way, boy. That's what tennis would say. Guys, I guess this is it. The dinosaur won. <laughs> it's, it's awesome to skate a, a ball this big, but something that I never ever felt before. <laughs> Samuel is just getting there. I'm gonna film the end of this video with Samuel grinding that thing. So something that I've never ever felt before was Let's see the back rail. Okay, now let's see it on the ball. <laughs> Something that I've never felt before, it's the G-force that a ramp this big actually applies on you and on your back. I've always heard about people skating the mega ramp saying that the G-force from the mega ramp sometimes just going down the, the ramp into it or sometimes on that launch ramp sometimes they can't handle the g-force and that's why the feet go up and they like one example was Fabiola Fabiola da Silva remember mm -hmm. she told us that the first time she tried to jump the mega ramp her feet just went up and she landed on her back yeah. in the in the in the landing so yeah and Fabiola is like a seasoned vert skater so for her to feel that, I can only imagine. For me, this was cool. This was a very cool thing and I'm happy that I'm able to share this with you guys. Yeah, this is plan B part one. The part two is coming tomorrow. I'm actually very excited for the... <laughs> I'm very excited for the next video. I'm probably only going to post it on Monday. Not sure. I might even post it tomorrow. I still need to think about it. I don't know. Maybe just if you haven't subscribed to this channel, here's what you gotta do. You gotta subscribe to the channel, press on that bell button right on the side so you'll get a notification every time I upload one of these. And then you're gonna like this video too because if you like this video, YouTube is going to suggest this video to more people and it's a way to promote skating. Other than that, I'm going to finish this video just like I always do and that's by saying do not ever forget why we all started skating and that that is because it's fun and now if you want to support this channel you can also click on that join button check the perks that I get for the supporters of this channel see you tomorrow cheers